Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Shen Plays. Welcome back to Germany here in Veritas at Fortitude Mod for Open Salus 4. It's been a few years since the last episode. We've been sitting at peace, coring up all of these wonderful Hungarian lands that are now ours. I guess if we take enough of Hungary, it'll be an accepted culture, right? Maybe. What's accepted right now, anyway? Durr, accepted culture. Bingo. Just Alemannic. That's it. <laughs> well, that's not true. Everything in the German culture group... Uh, is accepted. Anything that's blue here is accepted because it's the same culture group, uh, which is nice. That's 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 really cool. But yeah, Polish. Even though we have a large amount of Polish provinces, not accepted. Czech, not accepted. Uh, Aquitaine, Burgundian, not accepted. Not accepted. Not accepted. So in the meantime, we've been uh, starting the annexation of Urbino. He has already converted San Marino. He's cored and converted it to the right religion. So we're going to annex him. Get him out. Get him out of the way. Uh, the Pope is still Hussite. Unfortunately, Bosnia was annexed by Slovenia, or Slavonia, and he's already converting stuff back to Catholic like a jerk. Oh man, Athens has exploded! Look at Athens! Holy shit! Uh, we have been making plans, and I think one of the plans we have to do somewhat soon is taking a bunch of land off of France and selling it to our vassal, because our vassal has claims on every province that borders him, except uh, Paris, because you can't claim the capital. And I also want to go beat up Polotsk, because Polotsk has just peacefully vassalized Riga. So Riga, who we spent quite a bit of time getting them to convert, uh, the guy who immediately converted back to Catholic like a jerk, Polotsk peacefully annexed him, or peacefully vassalized him. So Polotsk now has Novgorod in a union, and he has vassals Yatvigs and Riga. So we're going to have to get in there and beat him the fuck up. This guy's insane. This guy's insane. He needs to go down. In the New World, we've been colonizing in the Louisiana region. We want to get a Louisiana colonial nation going. Which is simply a case of going to Osage, Ozark, and then Tonkawa. And the idea there is that will block off France from getting anywhere into uh, Ho-Chunk or anything like that. So if we get Shawnee, Osage, Ozark, and Onkawa, then he can't go anywhere. He's completely trapped. And that's the idea. Trapped in the Frenchies. South America, we sold... Vapes and Goiania, Goiana to Coffee House because they're actually in the Brazil colonial region. I didn't realize this was considered Brazil colonial region, but it is. So we sold them to Coffee House. Hopefully he'll be our Coffee House. Hopefully he'll be using that to go to war or colonize or whatever he wants to do. Uh, Oceania Colony, otherwise known as Koala Reich, is doing just fine. We're gonna move our troops out of the way, and we're looking to go to war in Majapahit, Makassar, and Kutai. Yeah, Portugal's over here now. We're looking to go to war to annex these three guys. So I think that's what we're going to do right then now. Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? All these clowns are in a coalition against Portugal because Portugal took one province. They all went in a coalition. Holy crap. So let's get in here and get our feet wet, get our fingers dirty, and... Yeah, we can call Castile into this war. Do I want to call Castile into this war? No, I don't think we need Castile in this war. He doesn't need to be in this war. No, no, no. And we'll go for Imperial Conquest. Our neighbors are small and weak because it makes it cheaper. You take a less, you take less aggressive expansion, and it costs less Diplo points to do this. Done. Now we don't want to, uh, we don't want to spend our entire time on Java Island. But we will use the beginning of this war, or the beginning time here, to march in here and kill his army. And then once we've killed his army, we can spread out and send the rest of our units to Makassar and Kute. Makassar is an 8 base tax province, very nice. Kute is a 10 base tax province, and Brunei is an important center of trade. So it's important that we get these uh, specific provinces. Natural Harbor, wow, that's a nice province, holy shit. Yeah, let's go get this stuff, man. Let's get this stuff, man. Yep, both of them have come into the war. Good times. Get in there and fight, maggot. Are these level 1s or 2s? They're level 2s. Okay. Let's slow down time. Speed 4. Speed 5 seems to be a little chunky uh, on the old CPU. Oh, Cahokia has finished. Great. So that means we have a colonist ready to go. Osage is next. There we go. Move on in. Alright, where's my troopy whoopies? There he is. Come on. Look at him with his little hats. Oh, he's adorable. 
It's adorable. Come on. Come on. Oh, he's trying to run away. No, 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 no. You're not allowed to run away. You are not allowed to run away. You are allowed to die. That is all you are allowed to do. Nothing else will suffice. You hear me, foo? You hear me, foo? I ain't take none of your shit. That's some bullshit. There we go. Oh my god, he's crushed. Holy hell, he's crushed. Alright, so let's separate out uh, little teams. I want one soldier and one cav in the capital. One soldier and one cav right here. The rest of us are going to go this way. Come on. Wow. It takes a while to walk around here. Damn. Okay, there we go. One soldier, one cav. To Madura. One soldier and one cannon. Just stay here. Move on. We need to take as many units as we can up to Makassar and Kute, because they're going to have considerable armies. Well, maybe not considerable, but they'll have quote-unquote armies. Eh, better than nothing. One soldier, one cannon, move on. Oh, look, he's building a unit. That's adorable. Look at him, he's got a little hammer, and oh, he's a blacksmith. Cute. I'm a man. I'm 40. You sure are. You're adorable. I realize some of our provinces here don't have level 2 forts. So we actually had to build some level 2 forts before this war kicked off. So we did. Well, they didn't finish before the war kicked off, but they're almost done. Alright, can we pick you up, please? Please? There you go. On the boat. To Makassar. Makassar is actually going to be important because we have two colonies on the way to Pose and Bone. And need to make sure that they get protected. So we'll have to drop off some soldiers there after this war is over. No, he actually wants to fight me. Yeah, we'll play some Jeu de Palme in Luxembourg. Why not? No, look at this. He's got some heavy ships and shit over here. Uh, how's that working out for you? Let's see if we lose any of our transports. We might. He's got uh, what kind of admiral? A 1 0. Alright, well. Haven't lost a ship yet. Nope, we win. La, la, la. Didn't lose a single ship. Nice. Off the boat. When do our colonists arrive anyway? Uh, they're about halfway there. Well, one of them's got a year to go. Yeah, it takes a while to sail over here. Traveling to Luxembourg. Good, 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 good. You're good. Luxembourg welcomes Johan the First Cicero. Great name. Fucking amazing name. Benign neglect. If it moves, tax it. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. The German East Indies. We must get this set up. We must cleanse the sun well. Come on. We won. Wow. We only played one shot, and it was over. What a shitty Jeu de Palme match. I mean, we won the Jeu de Palme match, but I would have preferred to have a, a match that went on for, you know, at least a couple shots. All right, two soldiers and a cannon will protect Jose. Two soldiers and a cannon will protect Bonet. One soldier and one cannon will stay in Makasa. Actually, is it a level one fort or a level two? It's a level five. What? Okay, so you're saying we need one, two, three soldiers and two cannons to protect. Okay, fine. Fine. Oh, excellent supplies. So we're only going to take 17 guys to Kute, but that should be enough. He won't have that much of an army. The problem is if he has large forts. And he does not. He has two level twos and two level threes. Okay. Fair enough. Wow. My, that province of Makassar. Thankfully, he doesn't look like he's built a march. I don't think you can build a march because he doesn't have a border here. Yeah. He can't do it because he doesn't have a border. La 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 la. Venice has started the Venetian-Hungarian the Venetian-Hungarian war. It doesn't even list the kind of war. It's just a war. Good enough, man. I hate you because you look different than me. Let's go to war. What? 
Oh, and uh, between episodes, Toman moved their capital to the Philippines, because why not? So, huh, we have an Irish colony that is now, I guess, like a colonial nation. An independent colonial nation. He only has one province left back in Europe. That's why he was able to move his capital. Kind of weird situation. Did not expect them to move their capital over here. Ooh. Yeah, give me a claim on Sweden. Thank you. You know what? That's what we should be doing. We should be claiming more Swedish land. Because we're going to be... We're going to be beating him up at some point. You know what? We should probably beat up France, too. Mm, yeah. Beating up France important. Okay, so let's get a claim on... Oh, shit. My vassal's losing his... Col oh, no. My vassal's losing his claims. I mean, it doesn't matter that much. He'll buy them anyway without a claim because of the same culture. Yeah, I guess it's fine. All right. I mean, I guess we'll just... Fabricate on plateau. Fabricate on plateau. Um, no, let's isolate his capital. Fabricate on Alençon and Nemours and Rems. Yes, Rems, 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 and on Sweden too. Let's go for. Uh, can't fabricate on the capital. Let's go fabricate on. Um, yeah, Talun, Falun. Base four, I like. Is that gold? Really? Yeah, no, it's copper. Damn. I didn't know the other's gold in Sweden. Maybe yeah, there is. Oh yeah. Well, there's his army. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Don't run away. Oh yeah, we got him. He can't run. Oh god, they're getting crushed. Squish? No, they're not gonna squish. They did, they squished! Oh my god. Their morale went to zero before the end of the month. Uh oh, rebels in Bornholm. That's a terrible place for rebels. Bornholm, you are a problematic place. Let's go to Bornholm. We do that? So Norway has beat back the rebels. Is he converting yet? He is not converting yet. Probably because they have religious zeal. Ugh. What a problem that is. Religious rebels are the worst, man, because their effects last for years and years and years. But yeah, let's go to Bornholm. One of the weird islands that you can actually walk to. And when he arrives, we'll spawn these rebels. Oh, wow. 5% chance of 11 rebels. No, not 11 rebels. Whatever will I do? 11 rebels. <laughs> oh my god. When they spawn in like Vienna, they spawn with like 65 guys. <laughs> but in Bornholm, only 11. Hmm. No, these missions are terrible. There's never any good missions, man. All right, Blam again has fallen. Go help out in Bali. And I wonder, can we get this guy as a protectorate? No. Oh. Wait a minute. It says we cannot protectorate him because he is too technologically advanced. He's Chinese tech group. How is that? How is that too advanced to protector it? Really? I think that's a bug. You know what though? I'm gonna get relations up with him. Not that we can get an alliance or anything, but I'm kind of seeing potential here for maybe, for maybe getting uh, some type of temporary relationship just so he won't coalition me. Right, and he does want an alliance. Hmm, I guess, yeah, that's that's worth it, because we have room now. Now that we're annexing a vassal, we have room for one more relation. Yeah, yeah, we'll just ally him. That will make things a lot easier for us. Done. And I mean done. Oh, there goes the capital. 
No, just stay there. It's fine. Stay there. No, 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 no. Stay there. Stay no, 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 no. Stay there. No, oh, god damn it. Don't auto save when I'm trying to give orders to my units. Come on. Stay there. Stay there, please. Don't go to Blam again. Stay in Surabaya. Thank you. Uh, yes. Kill the rebels. Holy shit. They got a two star general for the rebels. That's okay. I mean, whatever. We should go to war with Aragon to get Naboni for my vassal. Hmm. Yeah, we should. Because his allies are garbage. Give me Diplomat. Let's do that right now. Right now. Before I forget. This is a great idea. Uh, yeah. Now this one we can definitely bring Castile in. We do that? Yeah, why not? Oh, my colonist has arrived in Bone. Cool. Aragon. Yeah, we'll call Castilian for this one. Oh, shit. Portugal's the defender of the faith. Do I really want to fight Portugal right now? I don't. But... We might want to. Ah, uh, that's a distinct possibility. We don't need to take any land right here. Yeah. I don't see why not. This could not possibly backfire in any possible way. That was meant to be incredibly sarcastic. Um, let's do it. I wonder if Portugal's going to join. They might. Portugal did not join. Okay. So we do have the possibility of uh, taking Venice. Mm. Wonder if we could sell that to Urbano. Wouldn't that be fun? Oh, here comes Provence to take his land. Good old Provence. Always good for a laugh, right? I really don't want Venice right now. Look at that. 18 base tax. Holy shit. It might be worth canceling my annexation of Urbano. If we can get Venice and sell it to him. It's the wrong religion and it's the wrong culture. But I believe it's the same culture group. Let me check. Yes, it is. It's the same culture group. Huh. 18 base tax. You know, that's probably worth it. I think I'm going to cancel my annexation of Urbano just for this. Wow. I can't believe I'm doing this. But I am. Uh, yeah. Well, the next you later, Urbano. <laughs> Hang in there. God, yeah, I can't. so we wasted a bunch of Diplo points on that. Oh, well. No, you can't have peace, Kuntai. I'm going to full annex you. I'm going to eat you. I'm going to put you in my belly. Mmm... Kutai for breakfast. Alright, go to Surabaya. Are we in Bornholm yet? Yes, we are. Okay, spawn the rebels. There you go. Whoop de doo. Oh, wow, they died in one day. So threatening. They died in one day. They died in one day, sir. They did what? They died in one day, sir. You son of a bitch. Wait a minute, where'd Provence? No, 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 no. He's going to Venice. No, 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 Provence. Provence, no, Provence. Provence, you're going the wrong way. Fucking hell, Provence. Please follow my arm. Where are you going? You son of a bitch. He's going to Venice. Oh, fuck you, Provence. You have a core over here. Please, before Castile comes here. Oh, so now that Portugal failed to defend this Catholic nation, Japan has reaffirmed themselves as the defender of the Catholic faith. I kid you not, Japan is now the defender of the Catholic faith again. And Yap has called for a crusade against Venice. That's the spirit, Yap. Alright, so I'll see if I can uh, tug these guys to come to Narboni. Please come to Narboni. Please. Please. 
please. I beg of you. Looks like he does want to follow the uh, check mark. Oh shit, Castile's already. No, Castile! No! Provence, you piece of shit! Why did I call Castile in this war? Because I figured Portugal would join and they didn't. Shit, goddammit. Provence, you piece of shit. Stupid little asshole. And he's going the wrong way. I have my check mark turned on, and he's going the opposite direction. Provence, I hate you. Look at that. He went to Piedmont instead of following me. Please. Provence, please. Fucking hell. My head is going to explode. Provence, please. Provence, please. Okay, follow the check mark. Follow the check mark. Nope, he's not following. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. They're following. Provence is following. Yes. Yes, come on, Provence. Come on. No, he stopped following. Provence! There we go. Come on. Man, this is so stupid. Heir's stature grows large. Ferdinand has caught the attention of the people. Some are clamoring for him to take over the throne from Kaiser Johann Cicero. What? No, they're not. No, they're not. My heir's an idiot. What are you talking about? We're a 443 and my heir's a 112. You're a goddamn moron. Yeah, we'll throw a parade in his honor. whoop de doo Huh. What a weird event. I like that, that there's an option to abdicate, but there's no reason to. We're, we're, we're good, man. We're good. We're good. We're 443. Way better than our heir. All right, come on, Provence. Come on. Before this shit gets out of hand, yo. Shit just got real, yo. Provence, please. Provence, please. Pro 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 no, here we go. Here we go. Come on, come on, come on. Provence, come on. Provence, come on. Come on, dude. Okay, here we go. Come on. What worries me is Castile may not leave, right? He may just decide to stay, and that would really suck. <laughs> oh, God. This whole war is just to get Provence his land. It's his core, you know? Oh, shit, I'm at max points. Whoops. There we go. 12 years ahead of time. Whatever. Uh, Provence? Provence, please. Provence, please. Okay, there you go. There you go. Okay. And Castile has left the siege to us. And Provence is coming in to siege. And I can turn off the check mark when he gets here and I can leave. And he should stay there. Provence, please. Why is he not here yet? Oh, 27. Six, seven. He's here. Okay. Can I leave? I can leave. Okay. Let's go. No! Provence! No, no! Provence! Provence, it's your core! Provence! For fuck's sake. Provence. Check mark. Okay. Look, I'll do this a different way. I will... I will fight with honor. No, I won't. Uh, I will leave some cannons here, though. And I'll take this army with no check mark, and I'll leave. There you go. Okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Are we sieging, or is pro it's, it's us? No, 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 Okay, Provence is staying, and I'm going to stay there and help him with my check mark. Okay, we're good. We're good. We got it. Yes. What? What? No! 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 Oh, Navara, you traitor. I just got my well-trained vassal to sit. 
My vassal has been trained. And you just took a dump on the floor, didn't you, Navara? You took a big old dump on the floor. Oh my god, Navara. There's a special place in hell for people like you. <laughs> oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> the whole point of the war. Uh, uh, I guess I'll take Venice then. Consolation Prize, Venice. Fuck. <laughs> Alright, everyone meet up in Brunei. Wow. Wow. I don't even have words for that. That is... Oh. <laughs> Portugal over here having a ball. Like I'm in I'm in Brunei. I'm converting it to Catholicism. Yay! Shut up, you fucking Christmas tree. Milan has coalitioned us. We haven't done anything in years, and Milan's like, hey, let's coalition them again. Like, well, we left the coalition for a few years, isn't that good enough for you? We now we want back in. Because you're a sick son of a bitch, Germany. Nobody likes you. And you should probably go die. Alright, first things first. Uh, well, let's get relations up with you. Can we do that? Relations, go. Relations, go. Anti-coalition against Milan. <laughs> Anti-coalition. That term is just so awkward. Now, we're ahead enough in tech that I think I'm going to stomp all these flat so that they won't revolt. Uh, whoa! He's too big to annex. Really? That was unexpected. Yeah, just release Brunei. Okay, so we'll deal with him later. I did not expect him to be 100... 142% to annex. Wow. I hope Majapahit isn't that expensive. I guess we'll find out. I'll take your dollars. Brunei is certainly happy about existing again. I love existing. Existing is fun. So I guess you're gonna have to get on the boat. up. Go to Sumbawa, please. Sumbaya. Surabaya. Shit. Hey, Hussite settled in Bornholm. Nice. Gain some base tax in Posey. Okie dokie. Yeah. Colonists go. 142 expensive. Wow. Now we can't protect them. For some reason, Chinese tech group is too advanced to be protected in. So I think the protectorates are just not allowed in this mod. That's what it seems like. All right, we have our claims on France and Sweden. Let's get some more claims on France and Sweden. Specifically, we want Nemur and Alençon. So let's go for Nemur. Can we do? Can we do Nemur? Yes. Okay. And in Sweden, we got a claim on Falun. So let's get a claim on, um, I don't know. Let's go for Upland. Why not? Upland, go. Hmm. Scotland managed to hold on to it. And he also converted to Presbyterian. Wow. Well, Scotland's going to be uh, big on the whole colonizing thing eventually. I mean, they're getting around. <sighs> God damn it. All right. Is that going to be good enough? Should be good enough, right? To get rid of the black flag, I think. Maybe? Yeah. No more black flag. All right. Half of you on the boat. Let's go. The Pope has called for a crusade against Venice. Damn right. I don't 
quite get why Yap is the Pope. Yap has been the Pope for years. And he's still the Pope. And Yap is Shinto, so he probably shouldn't be the Pope. But he is the Pope. Why is a Shinto man the Pope? Pretty sure the Pope isn't supposed to be Shinto, but don't quote me on that. Okay, Colony in Osage has arrived. So we now have full control over uh, southern Michigan, Indiana, southern Illinois, and southern Missouri. Good. Mmm, base tax. Yes, the Pope is a king. Uh, that's actually true in real life. The Pope is a king. But uh, in this game, the Pope is a Hussite kingdom rather than a theocracy for some reason. I don't know. I don't make the rules, okay? I just work here. Uh oh. Oh no! No! Fuck! Lithuania's gonna flip back. Yeah, they got rebels and they can't handle it. Ah! Oh. All right, Santiago de Cuba. Oh no, we don't have enough transports over here. No, we don't have the transports here. Oh my god, we have two. Tra um, I guess we'll bring our navy home. Yeah. We're just going to leave 20 guys here and 20 guys there. Yeah, no, that's fine. We'll have 20 guys on each island, and my navy can go home. Okay, fine. Sure. And what am I going to use these two ships for? I'm not sure, actually. But let's head to Las Cayas, and you can... Yeah, why don't you come back to Australia? We'll ferry these guys home. They don't need to be here anymore. Uh, who's this? Bulgaria. Yeah, you got it. Hey, can you hurry up with Makassar, please? Oh my goodness. My goodness. What a freaking situation. Situation. Okay, there goes Makassar. So peace him out. Goodbye, sir. Goodbye. Nice knowing you, Makassar. Core that. Actually, do we want to core it? Or do you want to sell it to Majapahit? Or can, can we vassalize you or what? Are you small enough? Probably not. Nah, he's worth 123. Oh, shit. Damn it. Okay, well, we'll take these islands. We have, court, we have claims on all four of those. Might as well take them, right? Yeah, fine, whatever. So we're at 97% nine, overextension. 97. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, even Brunei's pissed. We just released him in peace and he's already pissed off. It's fine. Now these I think we will hold on to. Just go ahead and core them. We have claims on most of it anyway, so it's going to be relatively cheap. And we have an abundance, an overabundance of admin points. I mean, we just teched up, we're 12 years ahead, you know? I'd rather not tech up 12 years ahead, but we pretty much ran out of space. We had too many points line. In fact, military, just go ahead and do it. We're so far ahead. Ooh, what's this? Found the Indian Trade Company. One province in an East Asian trade port owned by Germany. Ooh, we get an extra merchant and global trade power plus five. I like it. Excellent. And we're still allied to Malaya, which is weird, but whatever. I can't argue with that. It's fine. Um, yeah. And we're going to have some revolts, but we should be all right. Um, let's add everything to the trade node or to the trade company. There you go. Perfect.
jihad warning happened to us? Really? Our steward reports jihad warning happened to us. What does this even mean? Uh, jihad warning. Any owned province is in the Muslim group. Oh. Whatever. Come at me, bro. Bra. Broheim. Brofist. Brosif. Still not really making any progress on Venice. Oh, wow. We just made 21% progress in one day. Nice. And we have a general who's a level 3 siege guy. Wow. Strunk. Super strunk. Brittany is embargoing us. Okay, whatever. Oh, poor Aragon. Wow, Hussite is finally settled in Bestogne, so I guess we can put you somewhere else, eh? Uh, yeah, let's... I don't know where I should put you. Let's go over here, because we, we seem to have uh, some awkward rebellions in, like, Marienburg and Kujawi and shit. Difficult to put down rebellions sometimes. So if we take Venice, we should be able to sell it to Urbino. And then we can annex Urbino, because relations are still good enough. Yeah, I gave him a big gift of like 25 ducats. 25 ducats? You so popular? You'd be the richest man at the ball, Urbino. Everyone will be jelly. Super jelly. Super jelly. Hmm. Scotland or Milan? No. One of these days, Scotland or Milan is going to show up in this list, and I can claim their fucking throne because we're the same dynasty. Actually, I don't think you can claim throne unless you have a marriage. Yeah. So that's not possible. But what, what can happen is you can get the union even without a marriage simply because you're the same dynasty. So that's possible. Oh, shit. Look at Polotsk. Polotsk is eating Kiev. Oh, God. Not again. Wait, what is this? The printing press in Landshut is now producing books and other printed matter. Since you can't build a university here, do you want to restore the old trade good? Yes or yes? Yes or yes? Well, gee, that's a toughie. Do I want to build beer or books? All right, where's a beer province? No, uh, beer. Beer is worth 0 0.81 ducats. Books are worth twice that much. Books are worth twice as good. So yes or no? I mean, I think the top one means no. So I'll stick with no. Yay, it actually, yes meant, yes actually meant no. Look at that. So that's what all those posters about rape are about. It's like, oh, when they say yes, it still means no. It's like, what? The governor of Quill's house has died. Oh, you can have a uh, diplomat. I want you to colonize Quill's house, please. Please colonize. Please. Please to be colonized. Uh, can you hurry up, please? You're taking some mad attrition out there, dude. Alright, go there. Whoa, whoa, game, don't crash. Okay, go there, and then come dock up in Norway. Because when you think Norway, you think Madagascar, right? That's I know I do. And then dock up over there real quick. And then dock up over there real quick. And then get your ass up here, because there's a fuckload of rebels over there. Oh my god. Hurry up! Alright, so we have an extra merchant now. Where do we want him? Probably the Baltic. Uh, we're starting to get a lot of lands in the Baltic, so we probably should have a merchant there. I mean, it's only 22% strength so far, uh, but that will increase. Uh, Kiev, we actually have a decent amount of strength there. 18% Kiev. Hmm. It's 12% there. Paris. 19% in Paris. Hmm. Where does Paris push? Paris pushes to Antwerp. Uh, no, I think I'd rather go to the Baltic. Yeah. So transfer from the Baltic. There you go. There you go. There you go. It's all good. All good in the hood. G. Right? Oh, Genoa wants peace. I didn't even realize we were at war with Genoa. Uh, who's this? Germany. Okay, so we've sieged up Genoa. Well, 
I hate to say it, Genoa, but there's nothing of yours that I really want. So... I mean, Liguria would be nice. 82% for one province. But maybe I could sell it to Urbano? I don't think I could sell it to Urbano. Especially if we're going to sell them Venice. It's just not possible. But yeah, that's a nice province you have there. 16 base tax. I'll keep it in mind for future wars, dude. For now, though, I'm okay just to keep it sieged up. Because it adds to our total war score. You know what's nice is if we we haven't really had any revolts over here with Hungary. I mean, I think we had one. But not much. Oh, we can add this shit to the Empire. Look at that. Cool. Glory to the Empire, right? Yes, yes. Autosave. All that stuff. Glory to the Empire. Glory to the Empire. Glory to the Empire. Glory to the Empire. Beautiful. Alright, so all of Hungary's lands have been added to the Empire. What about all this shit? This is all added? Yeah, this is all added too. Cool. And down here? Oh right, we can't. Because we don't own this yet. This is owned by my vassal, so we can't co we can't do all these. Okay. Well, soon enough. Soon enough, my friends. Mein Freunds. Alright, come on. Finish the siege. We'll peace out of the war. Go back to the we'll go back to war with Aragon again another day. But not today. Not today, man. I just want Venice. Sell it to my vassal. Annex my vassal. Move on. Come on. Rapido. Speed up. Speed five. Come on. Please? No, nope, failed again. I guess I can understand failing at 14%, but it's still embarrassing. You shouldn't do that. You should stop failing entirely, okay? Just stop. Just stop failing. No more failing? Can we do that? Uh, Makassar is now producing books. Right. Do we want to change it back to... What was it producing before? Makassar was producing cloves. Oh my god, yes. Makassar is going to produce cloves instead of books. Let's see, books are worth 1.6. Cloves are worth 20.88. Yeah! Win! That is nice. That is nice. 20.88. Wow. I like it. I want it. I want it willingly. We'll just have people in gap. Whatever. Rebels in Bali. All right, let's take care of the rebels in Bali. How bad could it be? How bad could it be? Let's find out. Bali. Um, it was a fake rebellion. Totally fake rebellion. And Majibahit is still in the coalition against Portugal for some reason. Don't know why. Found some fish in Bonet. Rebels in Limousine. Okay, but I already have an army there, so it's fine. Fucking Navarra, man. Fucking Navarra. What a douche nozzle. Out of all the douchey things to do. He's like, hey, I'm not sieging that province over there, and I don't know who is, but why don't you just give it to France, okay? Then no one will fight over it anymore. God. I imagine that's how the conversation went. I'm not exactly sure, though. Okay, we got our claims on Sweden and France. You can go ahead and finish your siege now. My Kaiser, we have lost, lost the siege in Santiago de Cuba. Yeah, because my fucking ships aren't there yet. So we're going to have to deal with that. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Oh. Damn it. Yap, stop calling for crusades, man. You're not the real pope. The real pope is Hussite. You ain't no Hussite. Where are my ships at? 
Oh god, we're still... We're still in South Africa! Please! Hurry! We have rebels! Oh my goodness. You motherfuckers. They're... Frisian. They want to flip to Frisia. No, I don't think so. I don't think so, man. That's not cool. Alright, come on. Cross your fingers. The siege will succeed. This time. In, um... 24 days. It will succeed. Oh, man. The phase is every 60 days. That's brutal. Rebels in Varmland. Oh. Hello. Swedish Patriots. It's like a Swedish meatball, but they play football instead. Uh, wow. Rebels and Gores. Really? Okay. Yep. To Gores we go after Venice, I guess. No, we can bring them over this way. That works. And then go back. There you go. Ah, oh, we failed. Shit, it takes two months to get through a siege cycle here. That's brutal. It should not take two months to get through a siege cycle. Reform the provincial governments. Yes, moderate improvements. Do we have a thousand ducats? No, but we'll, we'll pay back a loan or something. Whatever. Come on, take them out. Goodbye, Rebels. Yeah, we took a loan of 980 ducats because the stupid auto build uses way too much money. Should be able to set a lower limit, like leave me 5,000 ducats. Never spend more than that. Or never spend below that. Alright, come on. Succeed, succeed, succeed! No? Ah, failed again. Aha! Finished a colony, except I have nowhere else to go up there, so... Hmm. Alright, where's our colonists anyway? Oh, right, we're in Pose and Bone. Do we need to stay there? No, I think I'm going to yank him out of... Po well... It's getting pretty damn competitive down here. But, uh, no, I'm going to yank him out of here, because they're probably fine. They're fine. I'm going to spread out down this way to Penny Rill. And do I want Illinois or Wyando? Hmm. No, I don't think I want either one yet. I think... Let's go north to Ozark. That's a plan. That's a good plan. Block in Francy Pants. Calvinist Zealots. What? They're just passing through, man. Don't mind the Calvinist zealots. Whoa! 21,000 rebels. Are you shitting me? You are absolutely shitting me. There's no way that this stack is real. You are full of the poop. You are having a giggle. And wow, look at all those cores coming in. Nice. Are you having a giggle? Holy shit, hurry up! I got rebels, man! Oh, finally, Venice has fallen. Thank God. Aragon, give me Venice. He will not. Really? Oh, wow. <laughs> He's really close to giving me Venice. Like, tomorrow he'll give me Venice. Next month he'll give me Venice. There we go. Yay, we have Venice. Sell it to Urbano. And I'll keep my army there so he can core it and he can convert it to our religion and then I'll annex him. But with my army there, we should be able to handle whatever rebels spawn. Good. Oh, he's the happiest little vassal ever. No, you can't have a marriage. 
You were obnoxious and you refused to cede your own core like a whiny little bitch. I hate you, Provence. Go away and die. But you know what? That's going to do it for this episode. Thanks for joining me, guys. I've been Shen. You've been Yuka. Back next time where we're going to take out these rebels. Well, I guess I, I can take out these rebels off camera. I know. I'm special that I can take out rebels off camera. Mmm, yeah. Anyway, we'll be back later. Have a good day. Goodbye from Germany. Bye. We have Venice now. Doesn't that make us legitimate? Mm, I want to rule Europe.